The Burj Al Arab is the most expensive hotel in Dubai and the only 7-star hotel because others can't even compare. And today, we're showing you what it would look like if you were to stay at this crazily expensive hotel. Located on the man-made island of Jumeirah Beach, Burj Al Arab certainly catches an eye. It looks like the pharaoh of buildings in Dubai due to its design, and while it was a controversial statement, Al Arab is certainly an experience worth having. But the problem is, no one can afford to live in such luxury. So if you look at the hotel, it's standing at a whopping 321 meters, or 1053 feet, you can break your neck looking in the sky. But what's inside is truly shocking. This seven-star hotel contains 56 floors, 18 elevators, and 202 rooms. With the world's tallest atrium being 180 meters tall, the prices are insane. And I was blown away to see how tall it actually is. To take things into perspective, the Burj Al Arab costs $1,000 to $2,000 a night, which is just insane. Staying at the most luxurious hotel will cost you $30,000 a night, which is also just insane. The world's richest people come to live here and live in luxury. And let's just say it's imbued in every single element of this hotel. It goes without saying that the hotel is expensive, but why exactly is that? Well, let's find out. Starting from your very own lobby and check-in experience, you'll see that there are so many people always booking this place. I guess the world isn't so poor after all. You'll be stunned to see how luxury is imbued in every aspect of it. The reception area looks like you're in a futuristic dream, with a ceiling that looks like the shape of a spiritual eye, a sitting area and a rug that's probably more expensive than all of our houses. Just sitting and waiting for your turn gets you being treated with Dubai's expensive dates and other luxury amenities like towels, coffee, and some snacks. But as they say, it's the inside that matters, and once you see the luxury rooms and suites, you'll be blown away. The Burj Al Arab is a whopping 56-story building, and each floor comes with a butler's desk. Looking at its height, I was shocked to straighten my neck to the level where it was almost 90 degrees. Each entrance door is imbued with luxury, a unique design, and expensive heavy wood material. The duplex suite is one of the most popular choices for visitors, and the suite itself looks like a luxurious house. Inside the suite, you'll be welcomed with a staircase, a big luxurious chandelier, and a living room bigger than most apartments we have. From the living room, you can see the view of Palm Jumeirah. But let's be honest, there's more to see inside this luxurious suite than outside. In the living room, we see some of the most expensive couches, sitting areas, lamps, and paintings. The design itself is laid out in a way where everything is aesthetically pleasing. Everything looks gold-plated, which gives off a much more luxurious vibe in this hotel. And if you're someone who loves partying, then you'll be surprised to know that there's a bar just for you. From lemon, mints, canapes, and handwritten notes, you're going to get an experience worth a lifetime. The water here is more luxurious than going to a luxury hotel, and in the minibar, you have whiskey and other drinks, snacks, and everything you would like to spend days in this luxurious experience. Well, that is if you can afford to spend thousands of dollars a night. The bathroom itself is so luxurious that you have a phone attached to the inside of the toilet in case you get bored, and in the main bedroom, everything changes. From the most comfortable and expensive bed to a TV, sitting area, and a view of Dubai that only the top dog can see, the Burj Al Arab offers everything there is. The main bathroom makes you feel like you're in Vegas, because it has double sinks, toilets, bidets, a jacuzzi tub, and a walk-in shower. And of course, you get the most expensive Hermes gifts, which you can take home as well. But what about other luxurious aspects of Burj Al Arab? For starters, there's an indoor pool and spa on the 18th floor, which is open from 8am to 9pm. So, if you're someone who loves to relax, be their guest. And if you're into fitness, you get a gym in a building bigger than actual gyms, with equipment ranging from runners to weightlifters. There's also an outside pool, which is a much more popular option. And this pool is designed in a way where you feel like you're right in the ocean. The Burj Al Arab also comes with a beach club with a chic and chill vibe that makes you feel like you're in the Mediterranean. And let's say you've experienced everything, what about food? Firstly, the food here is very expensive, and you can get Burj Al Arab 24 karat gold cappuccinos that cost more than $30. There's a Skyview bar offering an experience unlike anything we've ever experienced. But the most interesting hotel in this building is the Ristorante L'Olivo at Almahara. Going into this hotel makes you feel like you're in the middle of an ocean. 
This hotel comes with an aquarium, making you hungrier than sharks. You can get everything from items that no one knew existed to your regular pasta, prawns, pizza and veggies. The catch is that they taste so good that you can easily spend hundreds of dollars and still not be full. Burj Al Arab itself is an experience worth having. It has luxury tight to every aspect and it caters to luxury lovers just right. You can spend thousands of dollars just to find out that you have just reserved a room here. So, how did it feel to join me on a journey at the most expensive hotel? If there's one key takeaway from this experience, Mr. Burj Al Arab is perfect for luxury lovers, for anyone who can afford it. And if you're a luxury lover, then consider watching the next video coming your way.